afternoon another tell you what no matter how many times I do these sat in front of the camera bits it's still not comfy I feel like a bit of a pleb well there you go anyway good afternoon I pretend I'm talking to myself good afternoon still it's, it's a lovely day glorious today that's why I'm squinting a bit sun's in my eyeballs anyway I'm still parked up in Sussex been here for two weeks now on and off um, we're still at Bexhill on sea we're here for another week I think on and off we've been over to uh, where do we go went back to Beachhead again the other day it was just wild here wind just awful absolutely god awful um, last weekend Sean came Project Camper and uh, Phil Fester's Van Adventures it was really nice to see them um, kept us company kept me sane brought some Battenberg just had a laugh really just nice come all this way and people still come to see you like you know what I mean it's nice um, I've got nothing no footage of anything we've done this week it's just just killing time you know I'm just killing time until I have to go back which is the end of the month go back up back up to the sunny right now um, and then September Debs is away for a, a few days and I'll be back at the peaks for a few days and stuff and um, what else am I be doing I'm hoping I'm hoping to go to the Overlander show I have to wait and see see what funds are like it's another 70 odd quid I could do without spending especially on top of fuel and whatnot especially when we're not working I mean that's why we're sat here now we're just sat here because it's free it's free to sit here don't cost me anything I'll, uh, I'll show you where I am in a minute by the by the sea and the beach it's it's like it's idyllic idyllic park up there's a bin nearby there's toilets there's shops there's a uh, Tesco there's being q uh, I've done some some jobs on the van on the truck I've, I've sorted out the floor which were squeaking needed some new batters putting down I've done a couple of doors I did the the water tank door the log burner door and I finished off the the corner of the cladding um, I think I've got some pictures of the doors or a video of the doors or something to put in but apart from that I've done bugger all and it's it's just I don't want to put another walking down the beach video if you know what I mean so well yeah I don't know not fed up before anybody starts messaging me saying oh you look fed up I'm not fed up just thinking think about money I knew it would be hard when we lived when we moved into the van to make money to earn money but uh, I could do with some more money but I don't want to be working 40 hours a week for it you know what I mean that's one of the ideas of living in, in this this lifestyle kind of thing Um. I'll, I'll put some pictures in of work I've done in other people's vans because obviously I don't know if, if you know or you don't know I was a carpenter for eight years had my own business um, did a lot of um, private work stairs doors floors kitchens decking all sorts of stuff wardrobes anything and then obviously Covid came kicked it kicked the business into touch that's why we were living in a van well, that's a different story um, but I've got a lot of the tools with me, so I've started doing a few jobs on a few people's vans. So I'll stick some pictures in. If there's anything that you think you might need a lift with, just give me a shout, send me an email. In the description, my email address is in there. Um, if I remember, I'll, I'll put it on the screen so you can, you can email me. Obviously, we're on Facebook and Instagram and whatever else. Um, but yeah, we travel all over. Obviously, with us being in the van, there's uh, it's only somewhere to park up. I can work. I've given people a lift before now, doing solar panels and other bits and pieces. So again, if you need a lift doing your van, just 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 give us a shout. So, this is the view out the cab window. As you can see, it's not too shabby. 
Nice, isn't it? Really nice, close to the beach. Bit of a drop light, you won't want to walking over the edge, you'll end up missing killing yourself. So, what have we been doing to the cab? Cleaned it. Back and cleaned it, it was uh, a bit dirty. Smells lovely now. Went to uh, Old Fridge this morning. I don't know if you can see it, I've got a makeshift tablet holder thing now, which is like screwed into the dash. I've done my cheap GoPro, my phone adapter, and I've done some wires that'll everything's charging up when I'm going. I think Izzy's in that mirror somewhere. She's busy playing on the grass. There she is. World of her own. Look at her. You know what to be eight year old. Eight year old living a truck. Not care about the world. Look at her. No cares. No cares whatsoever. I hope she looks back on these times and realises that how lucky we are. All, all of us. Why have you been stuck in a house? You know what I mean? Been stuck in school, stuck in work. She's seen me. <laughs> She's so cute. Anyway, yeah. I will look, I mean, like I said to you earlier, I mean, obviously work, money, whatever else, it's alright. Kicking the dick when you ain't got any money. But I look at the other side of the coin of being in the, in the truck. You know, I've had nobody else for me. Some bloke's just come up to me in his van, asking if it's alright to park here. He's been in his van for years, he's been everywhere. You just meet all sorts of random people. Or because you live on four wheels. In my case, six wheels. But you know what I mean. You get you get the drift. We've been here two weeks. And I must have spoke to 200 people. Locals. Up and down. Talking away. Now, they see the truck or they see the dog. And I've not had one bad experience with anybody. Nobody. They're all made up. Absolutely made up. Something we want to do. Something we've always dreamed about doing and then not got round to doing it. <laughs> Life's too short, isn't it? Pissing about. Anyway. Right. I'm going to bugger off now because I'll just be waffling shit again. So. We're all happy. Oh, by the way. Um, a nice big thank you to... Jeff and Pixie, always Van Adventures, for giving Izzy a big shout out. She was absolutely made up with that, saying what a good girl she was. Um, I think it was more Faith was entertaining her and not Izzy entertaining Faith, Jeff. So either way, we both got some peace and quiet for a couple of hours. <laughs> we got some peace and quiet from her and you got some peace and quiet from Faith. So hopefully we'll see you, we'll see you guys soon anyway. I'm back up in September. I'll give you a shout when I'm up there. I'll, go, I'll have a catch up, have a beer or something. See what's about. We might, anyway, give, you might, you might need to lift for your truck while then. So you give us a shout and see where we am. I'll be able to help you out. Right, so I'm off. Thank you very much. I'll put some footage in, pictures in. I don't know yet. It might be before or after or during this. I don't know. Still trying to make a an idea of youtube still trying to guess at it but we've had quite a lot of had probably 100 subscribers in the last month as extras it's been absolutely fantastic thank you thank you thank you for subscribing now i just want 700 800 900 and a thousand it'd be nice to grow the channel see where we can take it um well yeah thanks for watching thumbs up thumbs down comment if you comment i'll reply to everybody's comment um, take care. See you all soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.